Almighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. O most holy Trinity, have mercy on us. O Lord, cleanse us from our sins. O Master, pardon our iniquities. O Holy One, visit and heal our infirmities for thy name's sake. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from Lord have mercy, 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 Lord have mercy. Come, let us worship and fall down before God our King. Oh, come, let us worship and fall down before Christ our King and our God. Oh, come, let us worship and fall down before the very Christ, our King and our God. Have mercy upon me, O God, according to thy great mercy and according to the multitude of thy compassions, blot out my transgression. Wash me thoroughly from mine iniquity and cleanse me from my sin, for I am conscious of mine iniquity and my sin is continually before me. Against thee only have I sinned and done evil before thee, that thou mightest be justified in thy sayings and mightest overcome when thou art judged. For behold, I was conceived in iniquities and in sins did my mother conceive me. For behold, thou lovest truth. Thou hast manifested to me the secret and hidden things of thy wisdom. Thou shalt sprinkle me with hyssop, and I shall be purified. Thou shalt wash me, and I shall be made whiter than snow. Thou shalt cause me to hear gladness and joy. The afflicted bones shall rejoice. Turn away thy face from my sins, and blot out all mine iniquities. Create in me a clean heart, O God, and renew a right spirit in my inward parts. Cast me not away from thy presence, and remove not thy Holy Spirit from me. Restore to me the joy of thy salvation. Establish me with thy directing spirit. Then I will teach transgressors thy ways, and ungodly men shall turn to thee. Deliver me from blood guiltiness, O God, the God of my salvation, and my tongue shall joyfully declare thy righteousness. O Lord, thou shalt open my lips, and my mouth shall declare thy praise. For if thou desired sacrifice, I would have given it. Thou wilt not take pleasure in whole burnt offerings. Sacrifice to God is a broken spirit, a broken and humbled heart God will not despise. Do good, O Lord, to Zion in thy good pleasure, and let the walls of Jerusalem be built. Then shalt thou be pleased with a sacrifice of righteousness, offering and whole burnt sacrifices. Then they shall offer calves upon thine altar. Draw nigh, O God, to my help. Let them be ashamed and confounded that seek my soul. Let them be turned backward and put to shame that wish me evil. Let them, say, let them that say to me, Aha, aha, be turned back and be put to shame immediately. Let all that seek thee exult and be glad in thee, and let those that love thy salvation say continually, Let God be magnified. But I am poor and needy, O God, help me. Thou art my helper and deliverer, O Lord, do delay not. <clears throat> o Lord, attend to my prayer, hearken unto my supplication and thy truth. Hear me in thy righteousness, and enter not into judgment with thy servant. For in thy sight shall no man living be justified. For the enemy has persecuted my soul, he hath brought my life down to the, to the ground. He has made me dwell in dark in a dark place as those that have long, been long dead. Therefore my spirit was grieved in me, my heart was troubled within me. I remember the days of old, and I meditated on all thy doings. Yea, I meditated on the works of, thy, on thy, of thine hands. I spread forth my hands to thee, my soul thirsts for thee as a dry land. Hear me speedily, O Lord, my spirit has failed. Turn not thy face, face from me, lest I be like them that have failed. Turn not thy face from me else I shall be like them that go down into the pit. Cause me to hear thy mercy in the morning, for in thee have I hoped. Make known to me, O make, make known to me, O Lord, the way wherein I should walk, for I have lifted up my soul. 
Deliver me from mine enemies, O Lord, for I have fled to thee for refuge. Teach me to do thy will, for thou art my God. Thy good spirit shall lead me in the land of in the land straight away. Thou shalt quicken me, O Lord, for thy name's sake. In thy righteousness shalt thou shalt bring my soul out of affliction. And in thy mercy thou wilt destroy my enemies, and wilt destroy all those that afflict my soul, for I am thy servant. Glory to God in the highest, and on earth peace, goodwill among men. We praise thee, we bless thee, we worship thee, we glorify thee, we give thanks to thee for thy great glory. O Lord, King, Heavenly God, Father Almighty, O Lord, only begotten Son, Jesus Christ, and the Holy Spirit. O Lord, Lamb of God, Son of the Father, that take us away the sin of the world, have mercy on us. Thou that take us away the sins of the world. Receive our prayer, thou that sittest at the right hand of the Father, and have mercy on us. For thou, for thou only art holy, thou only art the Lord Jesus Christ, the glory of God the Father. Amen. Every night will I bless thee, and I will praise thy name forever and forever and ever. Lord, thou hast been our refuge in all generations. I have, I have said, be merciful unto me, heal my soul, for I have sinned against thee. Lord, I have fled unto thee. Teach me to do thy will, for thou art my God. For with thee is the fountain of life, and thy light shall we see light. O continue forth thy mercy unto them that know thee. Vouchsafe, O Lord, to keep us this night without sin. Blessed art thou, O Lord, God of our fathers, and praised and glorified is thy name forever. Amen. Let thy mercy be upon us, O Lord, even as we have set our hope on thee. Blessed art thou, O Lord, teach me thy statutes. Blessed art thou, O Master, make me to understand thy statutes. Blessed art thou, O Holy One, enlighten me with thy statutes. O Lord, thy mercy is forever, despise not the works of thy hands. To thee belongeth praise, to thee belongeth glory. To thee belongeth worship to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever and unto ages of ages. Amen. Our believe in one, one God, God, the Father Almighty, maker of heaven and earth, and of all things visible and invisible, and in one Lord Jesus Christ, the Son of God, the only begotten, begotten of the Father before all worlds, light of light, very God, very God, begotten not made, of one essence with the Father, by whom all things were made, who for us men and for our salvation came down from heaven, was incarnate of the Holy Spirit and the Virgin Mary, and was made man, and was crucified also for us under Pontius Pilate, and suffered and was buried, and the third day he rose again, according to the Scriptures, and ascended into heaven, and sits at the right hand of the Father, and he shall come again with glory to judge the living and the dead, whose kingdom shall have no end. And I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Lord and giver of life, who proceeds from the Father, who with the Father and the Son together is worshipped and glorified, who is by the prophets. And I believe in one holy Catholic and apostolic church. I acknowledge one baptism for the remission of sins. I look for the resurrection of the dead and the life of the world to come. It is truly meet to bless thee, O Theotokos, who art ever blessed and all blameless, and the mother of our God, more honorable than the cherubim, and more glorious beyond compare than the seraphim. Thou who without stain bearest God the word, and art truly Theotokos, we magnify thee. <clears throat> With mystic apprehension of the divine Spirit, and I 
I shall speak forth to the queen and mother. I shall be seen joyfully singing her praises, and I shall delight to sing of her wonders. Most holy Theotokos, When the great archangel saw the O Immaculate One, the living book of Christ, sealed by the Spirit, he cried unto thee, Hail, vessel of gladness, through whom the curse of our first mother is loosed. Most holy Theotokos, Hail, virgin bride of God, Thou uplifter of Adam and death, now of Hades. Hail, O blameless one, thou palace of the only King. Hail, thou fiery throne of the Almighty. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Hail, thou from whom alone, from whom alone didst blossom the unwithering rose. Hail, thou who didst bear the fragrant apple. Hail, Immaculate Maiden, fragrance of the King of all, and salvation of the world. Both but now and ever, and unto ages of ages, amen. Hail, thou treasure house of purity, through which we rose up from our fall. Hail, lady, sweet-scented lily, perfuming the faithful. Thou fragrant incense and most precious myrrh. I shall open my mouth, and it will be filled with the Spirit. And I shall speak forth to the Queen and Mother. I shall be seen joyfully singing her praises. And I shall delight to sing of her wonders. As a living and copious fountain, O Theotokos, do thou strengthen those who hymn thy praises, and I join together in the spiritual company for thy service. And in thy divine glory, make them worthy of crowns of glory. Most holy Theotokos, save us. As a clear and untilled field, thou dost make the divine ear of grain to sprout. Hail, thou living table that held the bread of life. Hail, thou unfailing fountain of living water. Most holy Theotokos, save us. Hail, O mystic heifer that didst bear the spotless cow. Hail, you Lamb that didst conceive the Lamb of God that taketh away the sins of the whole world. Hail, thou fervent intercessor. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Hail, O radiant dawn, which alone does fear Christ the Son, the dwelling place of light. Hail, thou who didst dispel the darkness, and reduce to naught the demons of gloom. Both now and ever, and unto ages of ages, amen. Hail thou, thou only gate through which the word alone did pass. Hail, lady, for by thy birth giving the bars and gates of Hades were burst asunder. Hail thou, most worthy of all praise, divine entry for the same. As a living and copious fountain, O Theotokos, do thou strengthen those who hymn thy praises, and are joined together in the spiritual company for thy service, and in thy divine glory make them worthy of crowns of glory. He who sits in clouds of glory upon the throne of the Godhead, Jesus, the Most High God, came with mighty hand and saved those who cried out unto him. Glory to thy power, O Christ, most holy Theotokos, save us. In hymns of faith, O praised one, we cry out to thee. Hail, thou mountain fertile with the fullness of the Spirit. Hail, thou lamp and vase of manna. To the senses of the reverend most sweet. Most holy Theotokos, save us. Hail, Immaculate Lady, mercy seat of the world. 
Hail thou ladder which raised all from earth to grace. Hail thou bridge which truly leads from death to life. All who sing thy praises. Most holy Theotoko, save us. Hail, O Immaculate, Immaculate One, higher than the heavens, thou who didst with pain carry within thee fa the fountain of the earth. Hail, O seashell that didst dip thy blood, divine purple for the King of the powers of heaven. Glory to, to the, the Father, Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Hail, Lady, who didst truly bear the life, lawgiver that freely blotteth out the transgressions of all. O an unimaginable depth, O height ineffable, O maid unwedded, through which whom we are become divine. Both now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. With hymns we praise thee, O thou, thou who didst weave for the world a crown not woven by hands. Hail to thee, O Virgin. Do we cry, fortress of all mankind, and rampart and strength and refuge divine. He who sits in clouds of glory upon the throne of the Godhead, Jesus, the Most High God, came with mighty hand and saved those who cried out unto him. Glory to thy power, O Christ. All creation was amazed at the divine glory. For thou, a one wedded virgin, didst hold in bliss. Spare the eternal Son, who rewards with salvation all who him thy praises. Most holy Theotoko, save us. Hail, all blameless one, who didst bear the way of life and save the world from the deluge of sin. Hail, bride of God, thou of great report and mighty fame. Hail, thou dwelling place of the master of creation. Most holy Theotoko, save us. Hail, O Immaculate One, stronghold and fortress of mankind, and place of hallowed glory. Death knell of Hades, bridal chamber full of light. Hail, joy of the angels. Hail, help of those who faithfully Pray unto thee. Most holy Theotoko, save us. Hail, Lady, fiery chariot of the word, living paradise, having the Lord, the tree of life in thy midst, his sweetness giving to those who have partaken faith, even though they be subject to corruption. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Strengthened by thy might, faithfully we cry unto thee, Hail, city of the King of all, great glory, great in glory and repute, of whom all these were clearly spoken. O Mount unhewn, and death beyond all measure, both now, now and, and ever, and unto ages of ages. ages. Amen. Thou spacious tabernacle of the word, hail, O Immaculate One, Thou see shall which did proffer the divine pearl hail. O all wondrous one, thou art the reconciliation to God, O Theotokos, of all who ever bless thee. All creation was amazed at the divine glory. For thou, O one wedded virgin, didst hold within thee the God of all. And if spare the eternal Son, who rewards with salvation all who him thy praises, as we the godly minded celebrate the sacred and all honorable feast of the Mother of God, come let us clap our hands together and glorify the God whom she bore. Most holy Theotoko, save us. Immaculate bridal chamber of the word, and aid to sanctification of us all, hail. 
all pure maidens whom the prophets did proclaim. Hail the ornament of the apostles. Most holy Theotokos, save us. For from thee the dew distilled that quenched the flame of polytheism. Wherefore we cry out unto thee, O Virgin, hail. O dewy fleece which Gideon did foresee. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Behold, we cry out unto thee, hail. Be thou our haven and our port, when we voyage on the sea of tribulations, and all snares of the adversary. Both now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. O cause of joy, favor us with reason to cry out un unto thee. Hail thou bush that burns unconsumed, thou light the cloud with unceasing shelters of faithful. As we the godly minded celebrate the sacred and all honorable feast of the Mother of God, come let us clap our hands together and glorify the God whom she bore. The godly minded children worship not the creature rather than the Creator. But trampling upon the thread of fire in manly fashion, they rejoiced and sang, Oh, praise the Lord and God of our fathers, blessed art thou, most holy Theotoko, save us. To thee we sing a hymn and cry hail, chariot of the mystic sun, True vine that did produce the ripe cluster of grapes, dripping wine to gladden the souls of those who with faith do glorify thee. Most holy Theotoko, save us. Hail thou bride of God, who despair the healer of mankind, the mystic staff from which blossomed the unfading flower. Hail, O sovereign lady, through whom we are filled with joy, and find our portion life. Most holy Theotoko, save us. The tongue of eloquence has no power to sing thy praises, O sovereign lady, for thou was exalted above the seraphim, when thou didst bear Christ the King. Do thou now implore him to deliver from harm those who faithfully reverence thee. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. The end of the earth to praise and bless thee, and cry out unto thee, Hail, pure maiden scroll on which the finger of God did inscribe his word. Do thou and now implore him, O Theotokos, to write down thy servants in the book of life, both now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. We thy servants bend the knee of our hearts, and employ thee, O pure maiden. Incline thine ear, and save us who are engulfed in tribulations, and guard thy city, O Theotokos, from every assault of her enemy. The godly-minded children worship not the creature rather than the Creator, but trampling upon the thread of fire in manly fashion, they rejoiced and sang, Oh, praise the Lord and God of our fathers, blessed art thou. The three holy children in the furnace, the child of the Theotokos saved. Then was the time, now is its fulfillment, and the whole world gathers to sing. All ye worms, praise the Lord, and magnify him unto all ages. Most holy Theotokos, save us. Thou didst receive the word within thee, O pure maiden, 
and didst bear him who bearest all things. Thou didst nourish him with milk, who by his nod didst sustain all the universe. To him we sing, O ye works, praise the Lord, and magnify him unto all ages. Most holy Theotokos, save us. Moses perceived in the burning bush the great mystery of thy birth giving. O chaste and holy virgin, the children prefigured this most clearly when they stood in the midst of the flame and were unburned. Wherefore we praise thee unto all ages. Most holy Theotokos, save us. We who of old were made naked by this by deceit, have been clothed in a garment of incorruption by thy conception. And we who are sitting in the darkness of transgressions have come to see the light, O maiden, who art the dwelling place of light. Wherefore we praise thee unto all ages. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Through thee the dead are made to live, for thou didst spare thee life essential. Those who before were speechless now find useful eloquence. Lepers are cleansed. Diseases are driven, driven away, and the multitude of very spirits are vanquished, O virgin salvation of mortals. Both now and ever, and unto ages of ages, amen. We hail thee, O blessed one, who didst bring forth salvation for the world, through which we have been raised from earth to heights above, O pure maiden. Thou who art the shelter and strong work, stronghold, bulwark and fortress of all who sing, all ye works praise ye the Lord, and magnify him unto all ages. The three holy children in the furnace, the child of the Theotokos saved, then was the type, now is its fulfillment, and the whole world gathers to sing. All ye works praise the Lord, and magnify him unto all ages. Let all earthborn mortals rejoice in spirit, bearing their lamps, and let the nature of bodiless minds celebrate with honor the holy festival of the Mother of God, and cry out, Hail, O blessed pure and ever virgin Theotokos, most holy Theotokos, save us. Through thee, O maiden, have we faithful become partakers of joy, that we may further cry out unto thee, Hail. Do thou deliver us from perpetual temptation, from barbaric attack, and from all the multitude of evils which we mortals suffer for the number of our sins. Most holy Theotokos, save us. Thou hast appeared to enlighten us and to be our sanctifi our confirmation. Wherefore we shout aloud to thee, hail, unsetting star which did introduce into the world a mighty sun. Hail, pure maiden, who didst open the up fast closed Eden, hail fiery pillar which doth lead men's nature to the life above. Most holy Theotokos, save us. Let us stand with reverence in the house of our God, and let us shout aloud, Hail, mistress of the world, hail, Mary, lady of us all. Hail thou who alone art blameless among women and beautiful. Hail, O vessel which did receive unto thyself the myrrh which was never before outpoured. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Hail, O ever-Virgin, who didst thou dove that didst bring forth him, who is merciful. Hail, boast of all the righteous saints, and crown of those who strive. Hail, ornament divine of all the just, and of all the faithful, 
our salvation as well. Both now and ever and unto ages of ages. Amen. Spare, O God, thine inheritance and overlook now all our sins unto this. Unto this is she with thee and entreats thee who on earth gave thee gave thee birth, O Christ. When thou didst wish through thy great mercy to take upon thee another form. Let all earthborn mortals rejoice in spirit, bearing the lamps, and let the nature of our dearest mind celebrate with honor the holy festival of the Mother of God, and cry out, Hail, O blessed pure, and ever virgin Theotokos.
God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. O most holy Trinity, have mercy on us. O Lord, cleanse us from our sins. O Master, pardon our iniquities. O Holy One, visit and heal our infirmities for thy name's sake. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. And forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, now and ever and unto ages of Amen. 
mystic apprehension of the divine commandment, the bodiless angel quickly appeared in the house of Joseph and said to our God, who at all times and in every hour in heaven and on earth art worshipped and glorified, who art long-suffering, merciful, and compassionate, who lovest the just and show mercy upon the sinner, who callest all to salvation through the promise of blessings to come. O Lord, in this hour receive our supplications and direct our lives according to thy commandments. Sanctify our souls, hallow our bodies, correct our thoughts, Cleanse our minds, deliver us from all tribulations, evil, and distress. Compass us about with thy holy angels, that, that guided and guarded by them, we may attain unto the unity of the faith and to the knowledge of thine unapproachable glory. For thou art blessed unto ages of ages. Amen. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto ages of ages. Amen. More honorable than the cherubim, and more glorious beyond compare than the seraphim. Thou who without corruption bearest God, the word in our truly fail, talk us, we magnify thee. In the name of the Lord, O oh Father, give the blessing. God be gracious unto us, and bless us, and show the light of his countenance upon us, and have mercy upon us. Lord of mercy, 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 most holy Theotokos, save us. O sovereign lady, bright of God, spotless, blameless, pure, and immaculate virgin, thou who without stain by thy glorious birth given, has united God's word to man, and joined the fallen nature of our race to heavenly saints, who alone are the hope of the hopeless, the help of the ready help of those who flee unto thee, and the refuge of all Christians. Despise me not an accursed sinner, though I have rendered myself unworthy by my shameful plots, words, and deeds, and through intellect. 
And that we may be accounted worthy to hear the gospel. Let us pray to the Lord God. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. We are going to stand, let us hear the holy gospel. Peace be to all. And to thy spirit. Reading from the holy gospel according to St. Matthew. Glory to thee, O Lord, glory to to thee, O Christ, our God, and our whole glory to thee. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever and unto ages of ages. Amen. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Forgive thee, Holy Father. Let us pray for the peace of the world. Lord, have mercy. And for pious and orthodox Christians. Lord, have mercy. And for all the civil authorities of this land. Lord, have mercy. And for the welfare of our armed forces. Lord, have mercy. And for our Father Metropolitan Joseph and all our brotherhood in Christ. Lord, have mercy. And for our fathers and brethren, past and from among us. Lord, have mercy. And for those who hate us and those who love us. Lord, have mercy. 
Lord have mercy. And the founders of this holy church. Lord have mercy. 